All right, one of the biggest problems that comes along with getting into an accident and screwing your body up is when you got to use crutches. You're never really educated on how to use them uh, and how to at least make them a partner in your healing, okay? Sounds lame, but actually, it's really important. Constant compression on your armpit causes constant compression up here in your shoulder, your neck, your vertebrae, your upper back vertebrae, tendons, right? In the wrist, in the elbow, hand grippers. Not to mention just how you end up holding your body. Hip flexors get tight, knee gets overworked. So I came up with some very simple stretching things that no matter how, in, how bad a shape you're in, this is gonna help you extend your spine, and get rid of the aches and pains on a daily basis. Maybe you do this in the morning and at night, right? One of the first things you're gonna do is get underneath your pull-up bar. What, you don't have a pull-up bar? What's wrong with you? Go buy a cheap-ass pull-up bar. One with neutral grips. Then, you know, you just get yourself underneath like this, right? Set your body underneath the bar, support one arm here while you're still supporting over here, get in here, hop under the bar, sink, and hang so that you can move around a little bit, just like that, stretching and moving. What that does is it actually opens up your spine because you're sitting down a lot, because you're healing, opens up your shoulders. Those two components can wreak more havoc than you can possibly imagine. If this gets all jammed up and this gets all jammed up, you get headaches, you get leg cramps, you get pissy, you get whiny, you get moany, and then people won't let you in the house. Who can blame them? You're a bunch of whiners. The other thing I developed was this. A way to stretch with these, okay? Keeping these open, like if you're uh, waiting for, you know, uh, you know, your uh, drive through your cub buying groceries or whatever, or at the bank. Get yourself kind of set up so that you feel really balanced. And then take one of your crutch apparatus, okay? And then just start doing stuff like this. Breathe in, breathe out, or like this. Forwards, backwards. Just getting the body open and moving got to move the body, you guys. It's so simple to, to just take care of yourself. Uh, that's why no one does it. People just ignore this. They sit, they watch the movie, they eat crap and call it a day. The other thing that you're going to do, you're going to get into a real stable position. So if this is your bad leg, this is your good leg, you're going to grab the wall. You're going to take your crutch and you're going to just start bending over a little bit and then back up. Bend over a little bit. Back up. You got to stretch the legs out. You got to move things around. For me, it was 40 days of keeping this straight before I could start bending it. So, those were the basic stretches I went to the very next day. Um, we'll go in deeper with maybe different modifications for different injuries later. All right, thank you.